Welcome guys to another reaction with the Toxic Channel. Once again, before we dive in and speak about the video, make sure to check the store guys. I have really cool design there. As you can see right now in the video. Out of this paradise I'm talking syncopated breathing Love every evening One, three, six, five Dancing every night Fading in Out of feeling And I have a new cool design right now. I just dropped. It's an anime, especially in the black t-shirt. is really cool. You're gonna enjoy it when you check it. And make sure to subscribe and send me suggestion. Of course, I'm doing all the suggestion. I finish with all suggestion you send me. I'm gonna drop them day by day, as you uh, as usual. And yeah, if you wanna support me, guys, make sure to send a super thank when you leave a comment just with a super thank, one dollar, not above one dollar, just one dollar from you guys, and it can change lives. I really appreciate it. And uh, subscribe and send suggestion and see what's going on in this video. This is Andrew Tate with Aiden Ross. It says Aiden Ross threw him in jail. Basically, he's I don't know what he said, but they went. I don't think he is, did this, but anyway, it's just the title maybe. But it's been a long time. They they didn't speak these two, and they enjoy every time their conversation. And I think Aiden changed. I think really Aiden changed because I saw some clip of him. He's really changed. He's my he 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 have thoughts now. He's not stupid to do what the fuck is. I I don't know. That's my opinion. I don't think he's uh, he changed. I think he changed really. He have thoughts now. He's thinking. He know what to say. He have arguments now. He can he can debate. He can have conversation. I think. Let's just check in, guys, and see. It's one hour. Be patient. Hello, old friend. Hey, old friend. How you doing? I'm good, man. I'm good. How are you? Hey, man, I'm good. I don't know if you saw, bro, but uh, I got some good little gains in from the gym. My transformation is finally coming along. Are you strong now? I'm pretty strong, man. You know, I could probably give you a couple. I don't know. I could probably put you up for some. I don't know. I can go at it neck to neck with you in the gym now. Of course you could, Aiden. Of course. You're right. You're 100% right. Well, he's you're kind of to... It's not like I would crush you like a little worm. No, it'd be close. It's it'd be competitive, wouldn't it? Well. 100%. And, and that's probably. Same as my camera. It's also an iPhone. That's why it's fucked up. Why you should have come to Romania without spreading a conspiracy theory all across the internet? I was going to evade my judicial process. <sighs> what? You should have just come here and show me who's stronger. That's what you should have done. Um. So about that, I want to apologize publicly. Um. I never really try to make you go back to jail. Uh. That was a very very big mess up on my behalf, and I'm sorry. You know. You know. I fuck with you. You in some way help change my life because now I'm lifting. You really sent him to jail, maybe of something he said? You go back to jail. Uh, that was a very, very big mess up on my behalf, and I'm sorry. You know, you know, I fuck with you. You in some way help change my life because now I'm lifting strong weights, and I'm not a drug addict anymore, and you know, I've been on my shit. So I'm sorry about that. How long are you gonna not be a drug addict for before you decide to start again? What makes you think I'm gonna relapse, bro? You always do. You end up slipping lean and being an idiot. Okay. I'm the most I'm the most strong I've ever been in my entire life. Have you not see, you do you not see the picture? No. Show me. Okay, check it out. And I want to know your honest thoughts, because people were kind of shitting on me, but it's pretty good. Alright, let me see. Let me clean my camera. Here's the before and after. That's a considerable and noticeable change. It is? Yeah, it's good. I'm yeah, proud of you. Fat. We see some You ads. are? Yeah, of course. That's good. You should you gotta keep training. Of course you're nowhere near on my level. I'd still crush you, of course. Well, of course, that'll of course. Be, that'll be true for the rest of your life. I mean you'll never exist at my echelon. Ever. You'll always be miles below me. But you're a better version of yourself, which is what's important. So you know? did I make you proud once and for all? Yeah, well, not once and for all, because you're going to relapse and fuck it all up. But 
currently, I'm proud of you. Currently. I'm not going to fuck it up. I'm locked in. Do you not see how, Look how healthy I look. I look healthy. I feel good. I feel on top of the world. I literally feel amazing. I feel amazing. Are you in Miami or L.A.? Miami, full time now. I knew you'd be one of those degenerate cities. Smart. Right, so you live in Miami. And uh, yeah, better than what LA. do you do every... Okay, basically it's stupid from my side to say it's better than L.A. because I've never been to America. So that's stupid from my side. I will take that back because it's really stupid. I've never been in America and don't know the difference between L.A. and Miami. It's just know the name of it. So I know nothing about it. But people who live there, they, they can know. They can say the difference that I heard some in the video. They, they say like it's uh, L.A. is like uh, they say it's the city, uh, the angel city or some shit. But I think it's the, uh, the devil city. Every day besides stream, just go out That's... and be, co be popular. Lift. Is that why? I lift. Um, let's see what else do I do? Um, I lift and I stream. That's really it. And I sleep. I, that's all I do. I'm a no life. I, I just, I stick to this and that's what I do. That's good. How's so what am I missing out there in the world? I've been trapped now for almost two years, unable to travel. Tell me what I'm missing out on. Okay. Let's see. Uh, I need to catch you up. Um, there's rat beef going on right now. I don't know if you care about that. Um, streamer beef. Tell me all about the rat beef. I super, I, I super duper care. I super care. <laughs> um, well, okay. You're not really going to care. I don't really care. Can I just tell you what I've been on? What do you mean I'm not going to care? I just said I super duper care. You call me a fucking liar. Okay. I said I super duper fucking care. Okay. Met Metro, Metro Boomin and Future dropped an album. Uh, oh. Whoa, okay. And uh, Kendrick hopped on the track. Shit. Um, and they're basically coming at like Drake and J. Cole and um, it's like rap shifting right now. So we've got to see what's about to happen. Yeah, yeah, wow. And, Whoa. And then, oh, and, then wow. and then Diddy just got caught trafficking girls and, pe and pet he's a pedophile. You know... <laughs> Yeah, I saw a lot of video about it. speaking about Diddy is a pedophile and uh, it's not funny to be honest. This shit is not funny. Uh, like I like I told you, the industry is really is dirty, and it doesn't work. It is not based on real talent, like we spoke in the other video. It's not based on real talent because it's really dirty, and they just come knocking at the door. And if okay, you want to make money, yeah, we're gonna make you super famous. So you have no talent basically you have no talent it's just they give you for example if you want to be a singer lyrics music beat of famous money that's all and then you're going to do some i don't know i don't believe in the conspiracy theory and shit like that but i believe that they're going to make you do some radio shit or some stuff like this and uh, when it comes to didi i i i really use to listen to his songs are uh, he made really good songs he's a producer he's a singer he make really good songs and uh, I, I used to enjoy listening to him and after that is like uh, when we see in the video right now he's a part of violence shit like that it's really sad to see that it's really sad because you don't know what he's hiding that's the crazy part he, he deliver music you don't know be behind music what's going on but you see that's that's really disgusting anyway uh I'm not list. I don't listen to him lie anymore. I don't. I don't give a fuck about what is going on with the industry with America. I don't care. It doesn't concern me. That shit is not for me at all. I just like to see these kind of things. Make it's just make. It's just for laughing and you know and taking some some notes like this. But it's just for fun and it's just nothing special about this kind of videos. Just for fun. Uh, what else? It's like when and uh, and I believe I believe in my side about what is going on in America and they were running after Diddy and shit like that and they didn't catch him. You you, you kidding me? They couldn't catch you? The you telling me the FBI or the CIA? They couldn't catch you? They could just they don't know you where you are? Come on! It's just a deviation from something else. It's basically what's going on in Palestine and Israel. They're just trying to take it, to take you somewhere else to focus on the other things. That's one hundred percent sure. If they're not taking you from that, that there is something else going on. It's a deviation. <laughs> How many unique positions to comment on this, John? <laughs>
it's it's kind of funny. You know, let me tell you something, Aiden. Something else, some more life advice for you. Being a whore. Let me, let me do let me do it like this. It's better for you to see the whole video. I think it's like this better, but I don't know. You can leave me in the comment if you do it like before. No, but I think this is how you can see the whole video. Fucker will get you in trouble. In general, let's forget Diddy in his case and whatever it goes in court of law, innocent, guilty, that's up for him. He's going to work it all out. Yeah. But in general, if you're one of them horny motherfuckers, you know those dudes on Instagram, those Indians saying boobs, vagina all day. <laughs> yeah. If you're in your whole life just being horny. Yeah, but it's crazy. Like, what he's saying is not a lie. Like uh, every time I see, for example, okay. When you see a video like, um, you know, the smallest video and stuff like this about, uh, I would not say pornography, but I would say like small video from pornography, like a beginning or some shit. When you enter, all of them are Indian. It's not racist or some shit, but it's just true. You can check it for yourself. It's not racism. You're going to be in trouble. Whether but you're not, sad. I would say this, but not Indian or like that. No, but it's just. I see them that that's what I'm saying like what he said right now it's a little bit true fight or not yeah whether you get the girls or not if you have too many girls Indian you got page. stress I don't know. you fuck too much you're gonna end up in jail for some reason or some kind of claims that have come against you or you're sitting at home all day jerking off wasting your life you need to just give up that horniness crap you know I've come to the conclusion that having sex with loads and loads of girls is pretty gay huh you should have oh sex God. to make children, because children are important. Yeah, but if true. you just want to have sex with girls, just put your little pee pee in and out, and then finish and go, "Yay, I had sex." You're pretty gay. That's gay. How is that? Okay, he's just making some rubbish stuff right here. Uh, I don't believe in this shit. What he's saying right now, I don't believe what he's saying right now because. Uh... He used to do it, so maybe now he's not feeling it because he doesn't fulfill. But as a Muslim, that's haram what he was saying. I would say that as a Muslim, it's haram. But in, uh, in, in other cases, like for the people who do not have a religion, so when they do it, it's just for the pleasure. And as he said, uh, make you gain no, but uh, to have a pleasure and have kids in the same time, like to have, a, to have a wife and have the pleasure with your wife, and then from that moment... Uh, you're gonna have kids of your own. That's something really, something really nice to to look for and search for. But instead of having like just uh, casual sex with no reason, no commitment, nothing about it, that's just fucked up. But anyway, what he's saying it's haram for as a Muslim. Just have a wife and get married. And have I kids. would never have sex without the possibility of there being a child made. Because that's wait, so you, you wait, you stick that Romanian penis in a girl, and you're expecting to. To come inside of her every time and create life. Firstly, firstly, I am not Romanian. <laughs> Wait, I know, but what I'm, but okay. So you, you think every time Apo you apologize? I'm sorry, for misnationalizing me. I, mi I hate That's that. Are you, are you cloned? Why do you care now? Are you soft now? Why do you care? I want to be factually correct on this stream. Fine, I'm sorry for the miss point here is being horny, and I know I'm telling you this because I know you jerk off probably like 18 times a day, little fucking weirdo. You need to get rid of that horny crap. Instead, train hard, worship God, make money, make some kids, and just calm down. If everybody would calm down, none of this would happen. But everyone's like, "Oh, I'm horny. I need to fuck six fucking girls, two dudes. Fucking like, just everyone just needs to chill." Two dudes. As an example of what you're up to. I'm not fucking a guy. Okay, anyways, whatever. I agree. Some example. Scrap beef. Um, so, yeah, that's going I, The whole diss shit's going on right now. We're waiting for diss tracks coming in and out. Um, but the, the Diddy shit is what's big, too. Like, it's crazy as fuck. He got his house raided um, for sex trafficking. Uh, Been there. <laughs> and then, Do you live near him? What? Do you live near him? I don't know, honestly. I, I think he like got his LA sh shit rated, but Diddy was doing weird shit. But he fled. He fled. He fled the country. Like he left, and he's he went to a, a private island or something like that. Did you tell everyone about it on your stream? Did, okay, was it really my stream that got you locked back up? No. 
Oh, it wasn't. However, however, that stream did go super viral. And what stream? Let me explain how the world works, but especially how Romania works. Nobody really wants to have the... So when that stream went viral, there's obviously my PO and, and the judge and a lot of people involved in my case who started to panic. And they're like, oh, this is going to be very bad for me if he does run away, which I'm never going to do because I'm innocent. Especially as everybody knows he said he's going to run away. This is going to end up on my plate. So they all panicked and increased my surveillance and started following me in unmarked cars and all this kind of garbage because of your post. That happened. But... I don't care. They follow, they've been following me around anyway, but that's the kind of thing that happened because of you. Because for some reason, I don't know why that one clip went mega viral, but it did. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, yeah, that was fucked up. I'll tell you what, though. Um, how would you like to, once you're considered free, because all these girls are finally like taking back what they're saying about you. So once you finally get freed, uh, how about we? Uh, I take you out to some dinner? On me. Some good what stuff, bro. I thought, I thought I saw something like... Oh. Oh, no. Bro, they never said anything about me in the first place. That's what I'm That's saying. The point. Oh, really? So then what, what were they, What was the statements that were being said or something like that? So you're saying that the girls have now changed their minds and are re removing themselves from the case. That's good, right? They, no, no. They haven't changed their minds. They never said anything bad about <laughs> me and never wanted to be in a case. Wow. From the beginning. The state made the case. With girls screaming, saying I'm innocent, me screaming, saying I'm innocent, everyone saying I'm innocent, the state made the case. And only now, after two years, does the judge give them the chance to leave the case. That's so wrong. Bro, it's a matrix attack. It's a matrix attack. And they're doing it to me because I was ma massively influential and they were scared of, of the influence I had. Well, so they tried to well, you, well, well, you, you, you literally are part of the reason why this new generation clip farming is a thing, right? Like clippers and clip farming. You probably don't know what that means, but you are probably one of the biggest to do it. So they banned you on TikTok. They basically banned you everywhere except for X now, which is amazing. Shout out to Elon. Um, by the way, do you know Elon? But I was an instrumental in the breaking of the Matrix. If you actually time my cancellation... If you time me getting deleted on Instagram, that's exactly when people's consciousness started to awaken and understand that we're being lied to on every single level. If I had to mar my social media accounts to awaken the next generation to the satanic rituals which they're living under, then it's completely worth it. So I actually have been massive for damaging the Matrix. Me alone, as one man, along with others, of course. I've been I've been monumental for this movement. Yeah, I agree. Um, so it's worth it. No, it is. Uh, wait, what did you what do you think about the whole Ryan Garcia? What's been going on with Ryan? I love Ryan. And I hope the best for him in all realms. Uh he he says some things which are controversial and outlandish, but in the world today, it's really not so far fetched. My only concern is I think he should focus on his upcoming fight, because he's got a, a difficult one and he's no walkover. I said the I same. I said the same exact thing, and people were saying that I'm. Wor I work for them. I literally said the same thing you just said. Yeah, but you can't be trusted, though. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm Chuck G. I don't sell my soul. I don't end up on lean. I'm not some dickhead in Miami jerking off. I'm not like you. I'm built different. You, when you say shit, it is kind of like, mm, who paid him? He'll do anything for a buck. Think about. By the way, you know, I, um. I paid a rapper, a very famous rapper in my world. Okay. Yeah, he, he, I, didn't, I, don't, I hate when he, he brings this kind of rapper, he gives them a lot of money and then they scam him. I, they scam him in his, in his face. That's so stupid, bro. How, can you, how the fuck are you going to let them do that? It's like just crazy. He brings these rappers. Uh, it's basically, I didn't throw through him. I started understanding the streamer. He was, for me, he was the biggest streamer uh, I know. I know now there is a lot of streamers doing it but Aiden was the first doing it and go big now you have a show speed with it but he was anyway I don't understand how he let this kind of scra scrammer, a scammer like into this kind of rapper scam him on live in front of million people watching him that's so stupid probably like number one his name is Playboy Cardi to come on stream Playboy. And he scammed. 
It's kind of, yeah. I don't want. I don't. I don't know who he is. I'm sure he's a very talented man. He scammed how? What are you talking about? Well, he was supposed to come on stream for about an hour and talk to me about his album, and he came on and uh, basically did the exact opposite. He came on for five minutes, grabbed a bag of money, and left. Because you're stupid. Yeah, you're annoying. So it's he probably just you know that doesn't sound like a scam. It sounds like a robbery, G. Well, I want to ask you a question. Can I show you how he dresses? Dresses? Do you do you do you carry or are you strapped? It's Miami, of course. Okay, so why did why did you let him just rob you like that? Well, he didn't get all of it. But look, this is what he got caught wearing uh, the day after. What the fuck is this? Why? You know, it's weird because. <laughs> Every single no, you're just you're trying to get me in rap beefs. I'm gonna end up getting <laughs> dry. On. I I don't want to get in rap beefs. You're trying to get him dissed by uh, some rappers and shit. Dude, you're telling me about this rap beef and these people are doing this diss track and Lamar and Cole and I I don't really know who a lot of these people are. I'll be honest. I'm my my music taste is eclectic and I'm sure I've heard their music and I'm sure I like their music, but I don't know their details of their life what i will say and this is not in any way aimed at the person who robbed you is that why is everyone <laughs> why did everybody just put what why is everyone gay all of why is every all the entertainment industry the streamers on kick all of no, you hey why are you all fucking painting your nails and doing weird shit? I'm not, I don't, bro. I can't even just wake up and say, I have a girlfriend and we have a family and I have children. I, I respect my family and maybe I have three or four wives and three or four baby mamas, whatever. That's fine. That's acceptable. It's normal when you're a big G. And I make my money and that's it. Why are you, why is everyone, what have you done, Aiden? It's not me. You think it's me, but it's not. You, are, you have a huge stream. Lots of people watch you. You must have done something. What did I do? Everyone, it's just, and you know what it is? I watch. He's just shitting on him. He's just shitting on him. I don't think Aiden did this kind of things. He did. He did some stupid stuff. He did. He do some stupid stuff in the video, but I think he changed from that. From that, especially when he get banned from Twitch and now he he have percentage on kick. I think Aiden changed. If I ever watch TV or anything, it's just like everyone is just so fucking feminine and weak <laughs> or or the ones who aren't feminine think it's cool to like do weird shit is it just a, is are people just attention seeking what is what's going on explain this to me aiden well it's just my generation bro it's fucked it's fucked up and honestly it's only the western world like it's not like that in yeah. like other places in the world which i've realized it's just it's fucked i'll tell you what it is they're just pushing agendas bro they want basically the kids to be gay and I'm, As I said in the, uh, my other video reacting to Andrew Tate, it's only in the West. It's not in the Middle East. Even if it is, you're not going to see it pushing it like they are pushing it in America. You're not going to see it in Africa at all. Maybe just one, two, three, but not at all in Africa. I'm telling you what's going to be next. They're going to normalize pedophilia because when you allow 13-year-olds to eject themselves with needle hormones that make them, you know, women and boys or whatever, like cross basically becoming a tranny it really is bad you're you, you are you're, people are allowing children to do that so if, it's just getting bad man they're normalizing everything down here it's really bad you're totally it's totally true but why are all these famous entertainers not thinking i have a huge platform young men watch me i should probably not do anything that's too yeah. gay um so i am aware of that and i you know i, I don't think i do anything gay Aiden, <laughs> your whole fucking shit version of comedy, your pathetic attempt at being funny, is sniffing chairs. Hey, you're 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 as bad as everybody fucking else. No, what's wrong with you? You have spit right here. Lick your lip. Sorry. Okay, I listen, bro. Exactly. I don't point. sniff chairs anymore. Oh, you're you're in, you're in rehab. Bro, I lift. I lift. No, no, fuck up. You are a fuck up. I lift weights. I lean. You, you fucking. I am lean now. No, lift not anymore. Chairs. No. 
How oh, are you going to talk? Leave your fucking crib, bro. Leave the country, I, bro. Leave. I can't leave the country. I, I know. Can't. I can't leave the country. I know. All the judicial authorities here publicly that I have no intention of leaving. Hey. Don't listen to Aiden Ross. <laughs> I'm staying here in Romania where this shit isn't allowed. I'm staying over here because I'm scared to go anywhere near Aiden. He's weird. Hey, when do you want to go to dinner? Promise you've stopped sniffing chairs forever. I swear my life I've never, I haven't sniffed a chair. They, they want me to all the time, but I don't do it. Next time you sniff a chair, I want everyone to bring up the fact that you promised me that you've re, you've recovered from this terrible habit of yours. Last time I sniffed the chair was... Last time I sniffed the chair was years ago. Promise. And then next time you were around all... What the fuck is this sniffing chair? What, 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 it's a phantasm? What, what is it? Fetish? What, what the fuck is this shit? These entertainers and stuff. I just wanted to ask, why are you all... Just ask and find out. I need an answer. I'd like to know. I, I'm telling you why, man. These agendas that are just being pushed. So how do you think it works? How do you think they come to people and, and try and convince them to... To be gay. Promote these agendas? Well, I'll explain it. And you know I'm not the best explainer, but you can kind of like understand what I'm about to say. So it used to be in this world... Male, female, and race, which would separate us as equal, right? Like, and what I mean is segregation. You look at the world as a circle, like a pie, and you put a dash, male, female, another dash, uh, race, another dash, this, that. Now it's genders, and now it's all these weird little fetishes, and now it's all these, like, now you got real motherfuckers that are ruining the world, like... So, like I also heard yesterday, which scrolling on Instagram, I'm no, I'm no Christian, but I heard yesterday in a, a PBD saying in his uh, podcast, it's a clip. He says that uh, Biden just uh, pushed that uh, Eastern for the Christian. Eastern supposed to be for the Christian. They're gonna, not gonna celebrate Eastern, but they're gonna celebrate transgender instead of easter and eastern is supposed to, 31 march they're going to celebrate the transgender movement instead of eastern i thought eastern is for christian oh so basically everyone is uh, going against each other if that makes sense they're trying to just separate people when in reality all the people need to stick together and go against the people that are trying to separate us people if that makes sense this is actually an interesting topic and it's interesting enough for me to bother changing cam so i'm gonna i'm gonna change camera to make it maybe like this is better anyway we're gonna see what they're gonna speak about but before we move to uh, i just gonna put here like make sure to subscribe guys and if you want to support me to do much more reaction and suggestion from you guys just one dollar as a super thank when you leave a comment just one dollar it can change really lives and i really appreciate it subscribe send suggestion and let's dive in what they're fucking talking about. Go to my podcast studio and call you back. Okay. Thumbs up, Aiden. Go, go. Hang up, old man. You don't want to use your fucking internet? You're that old, huh? No technology, huh? You have no technology knowledge. Hey, hit the red button. With this one here? Fucking old. Hit it! Well, now I look stupid. 